This is From the Gnome, and we are starting part four of my playthrough of Thimbleweed Park. For those of you that are watching on Twitch, you'll know that we're still going from where we started part three. For those of you on YouTube, you can come watch live on Twitch at twitch.tv slash People on Twitch, if you want to go see the old uh, recordings of any of my videos, you can find those over on youtube.com slash with the number one at the end, for round one. All right, so continuing on, we are going to go, let me make sure he's got it. Yep, the ID card. We're going to go to the hotel and try to find the ID for the uh, person that was murdered. Which I think is going to be this way. Thought it was. Hello, Reno. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It is uh, uh, quite annoying. No, sir. Yes, sir. They have been taken care of. Yes, sir. Permanently. Oh, yes, sir. Violently. No, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, wrestling was quite good tonight. Goodbye, sir. Okay, then. Welcome to Quickie Pal. Can I help you find anything? Yes. Hi there. I'm Quickie Pal Leonard. How can I help you? I'm Junior Special Agent Reyes. Uh, I'm not Holden, if that's what you're thinking. <laughs> Do you know anything about the body by the river? No, but I heard the sheriff nearly ralphed when he saw it. The only bods I've seen lately are the righteous babes at the top shelf of the magazine rack. Let's not go there. <coughs> Have you seen anyone acting suspiciously around town? Actually, now you mention it, I did see something suspicious a couple of nights ago. I was on the late shift getting ready to close up and grab some za when Willie the town bum walks in. Was totally whack when I think about it. Why did Willie seem suspicious to you? Well, normally we have to toss him out because the dude smells grody and he never has any money. But for the first time in forever, Bro pulls out this wallet and flashes a fat stack of dead presidents. I thought it was kind of bitching when he bought out the liquor cabinet. Could the wallet you saw have belonged to Willie? <laughs> oh, no way! That wallet was his! I figured he got lucky and found it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But come to think of it, I'm pretty sure the wallet had some weird red stains on it. At the time, I thought it was the cherry mouthwash he drinks, but it could have been blood. Yeah, think. Tell me a bit about yourself, Leonard. Dude, how do you know my name? Are you, like, telepathic or something? No. You just told me your name, and it's also on your name tag. Do you like your job here at the Quickie Pal? Heck yeah! I got a freaking sweet deal here, with free coffee and minimum wage. Plus, I don't get many customers on the late shift, so I get plenty of time to think. You said you get a lot of time to think. I'm like an abstract thinker way ahead of the curve man my mom says i should be more like my cousin bernard who got a scholarship to mit but why be like that dweeb when i could be like chuck edmund tell me about chuck <laughs> he's my freaking oh, hero man dude never went to college just started building his machines when he was a kid that guy made this town rich just by doing what he loved you seem to really admire Chuck. That's why I dropped out of high school. I don't want to live my life for the man like some peon in a polyester cage. No offense. None taken. Ah, these flickering lights are going to drive me insane. <laughs> yeah, it's a trip, isn't it? Oh, they're even better if you get a little toked up and... Uh, <laughs> I mean, yes, officer, I'll get those fixed right away. What do you think about the state of the town? 
Just ignore the losers who say this town is over. I mean, pff, not even. We got everything a person could ever need here in the quickie pal for one. I'm going to look around your store. Another speck of dust. Woohoo! All right. Do you know my cousin Bernie? I'd play if it were a sure thing. It is. I know the numbers. Use. I'm here to serve. That doesn't seem to work. Ah. Uh, I was going to use those numbers I saw at the newspaper place. Two two seven. Nothing there. Don't forget to smile. If it looks hungry. I don't have an extra finger though. That doesn't seem to work. Let me know if I can help you find anything. Use this with I can't put it in there. Whoops, that didn't work. Oh well, let's see what else works. How about that sunset? Bear repellent. Get out of the way, Leonard. Get out of the way, Leonard. You're in the freaking way. Maps. There aren't any maps left. Sorry, little dude. The sheriff came by a bit ago and nabbed all the maps. Didn't even pay for them. Something about immature dominion or something like that. Imminent domain. Let's see if I can game If I had something here. to mail, this might work. I'd play if it were a sure thing. Come on, Leonard, move. Leonard. There we go, we got him How to move. How can I help you? Uh, I'm not holding if that's what you're thinking. All right, all right, all right. I'm going to look around your store. Go quick, quick. All right, get, get, come on. Take it. Got it. It was a sample from a traveling animal <clears throat> repellent salesman, but I doubt if it actually works. I wouldn't want to find out. I got a feeling we're going to find out. Oh, um, guess I'm on camera. Yeah. I'm here to serve. Reading cards. It's an I'm sorry you were caught out of the inheritance card. <laughs> it's an I'm sorry you were caught out of the inheritance card. It's an I'm sorry you're feeling like a beep card. Gee, <laughs> it's an I'm sorry for forgetting your birthday card. That's sweet. How about that sunset? That dude is It's off. an I'm sorry your hamster died card. Oh no. It's an I'm sorry you were caught out of the inheritance card. Oh, there's one missing. Let me know here. if I can help you find it. It's an I'm sorry for being a dick card. <laughs> can I pick that one up? How rude. Only a dick would buy this card. Do you know my cousin Bernie? Oh, man. It's an I'm sorry your face won't come off card. There's a picture of a clown with a lot of hair. No, thanks. Sure are a lot of Can them, Can I pick though. up any of them? Uh, guess no one's really sorry about this. I Isn't this kind of rubbing it in? <laughs> no, thanks. Not very nice for a greeting card. I never forget birthdays. Don't need this card. Let me know if I can help you find anything. I don't know anyone with a dead hamster. Alright. Nothing on that road. Nothing on that road. Do you know my row. cousin Bernie? Nothing on that road. No, I don't know your cousin. Nothing there. Let me know if I can help you find anything. Can you tell me what I'm supposed to get from your store so I can get it and get out of here? Didn't think so. Yeah, nothing in that. Want to buy a fine leather jacket? Not really. Unless it's important to finishing the game hmm I don't see anything else is there anything I need to give Do you know him? my cousin Bernie he might like the ET game he doesn't want it didn't figure he would all right out of there I need a tube to make that work I'm sure Man, that just doesn't work very well. Nothing lights up on that sucker. Bathrooms. Okay. Let's 
It's got to be a light switch. There it is. Oh. <laughs> Oh, no way am I going to look in there. I can smell it from here. Saves trees. Employees must always wash their hands. Huh, I look good. Huh, I look good. It looks like a really big tube. Ugh, they're all used up. Lots of super absorbent paper on this roll. Let's pick that up. Thank you. Don't suppose I'd get any more. One sheet is enough. Okay. Can I pick up this tube? It's stuck. Okay. Oh, there's a dust particle. I'd rather not. I can <laughs> imagine what it looks like in there. Can you open it now that I did that? I'd rather not. Okay. I can imagine what it looks like in there. That would just clog it up and flood the bathroom. That was my idea. Oh, can I do this? Uh, no thanks. The water is turned off. Hmm. Can't think of anything else to use here. Nope. The only way I know how to use it is throw stuff in it. Okay. Saves wildlife. <laughs> Not sure what that was good for. Throw it away? I don't think so. Can't make this bathroom smell any worse. Bye bye, tuna heads. Throwing it away. That doesn't seem to work. Throwing it away. <laughs> the game said you can't screw up, so if it's letting me do this, then there's a reason. Throwing it away. Now I don't think so. Oh, no way am I going to look in there. I can smell it from here. Oh, no way am I going to look in there. I can smell it from here. <laughs> I'm worried. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> oh, hold it, hold it. Sewer grate. It doesn't work with that. Something I need to throw down in there, I'm sure. Ugh, smells awful. Hmm. Probably don't have it yet. Oh, 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 oh. Dust particle. Why aren't you going? Anything here? There, nothing. That doesn't go anywhere. Whoa, there, little agent of Reno. You What's can't up, just Sheriff go Arino? bubbling around the county without a map. It's too easy to get lost, and there is a killerino on the loose. Won't you give me a map, Arino? A map? Seriously? Oh yes, and not just any map, but an official map. 
And where would I find this official map? Well, the county is plumberino out of them. That's because she just took really them all. messes up your investigation. I'm sure the head office will understand, Reno. Shall I mark the case as unsolved? Nope. Not a chance. The feds never give up. I see. I'm a federal agent. I can take care of myself. And a darn fine agent, I'm sure of. But we have laws around here, and everyone is required to have an official map. Aren't there some donuts that need eating? <laughs> well, you got me there. Oh, those donuts aren't going to eat themselves. But we have laws around <laughs> here, and everyone is required to have an official map. I need a map. Yeah, you're uh. right. I'll head back to town and find a map. Ooh, donuts do sound good. They do. I need donuts. Mm. I can't get out there to talk to Dolores. I can't get out there to talk to the clown. I gotta find a map now. won't let me go out that way will it darn it I need a mapperino I'm stuck a Reno can I use this maybe I can break this on the it's thing. an empty whiskey bottle nope. definitely not the murder weapon <laughs> wrong sized body hole It doesn't work with that. Mm. Maybe. It doesn't work with that. Oh, hold it. It doesn't work with Aww. that. All right. I need a mapperino. Dang it. Let's go back to the bathroom. I'd have to open the lid to toss this, and I'm not going to do that. Very plush for thimbleweed toilet paper. It doesn't help. The mirror is caked with decades of... Uh, I don't want to know what. I can't pull that. I can't pull that. Okay. <laughs> that probably wasn't the best idea. Mm -hmm. He's not going to open the thing, so we're not going to do anything there. There's an area back here. No, 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 keep going. There's gotta be something back there. Uh, I didn't work. Sheriff Reno. It's got some answering to do. I use this with this. It doesn't work with that.
That wasn't there before. They must have moved the body from the river. Cool. <laughs> yeah! You scare arena of me! I mean, scare uh -huh. me. <laughs> That's right. Uh, sorry about that. What is that creepy violin music? I have no idea. It comes through the plumbing. Okay, back to sleep a who. I really can't use this with this. It doesn't uh, work with that. I can't pull that. I can't push that. Mm. What am I missing? It's turned off. We interrupt our hostile takeover non-stop music with this important message. Strange signals are being transmitted by the government over the airwaves. We've taken over the radio station until they stop. And now back to our special hostile takeover song. <laughs> I might break the tube. Well, that was the idea. I don't want to pick that up. Mm, standard CD issued desk, but with no drawers. Wanted. Pickle Bill and the Cucumber Gang. Wanted. Shady Jane and the Sunshine Gang. I wonder if I can Attention, make them do no units. <laughs> Enough screwing around. I've got a case uh. to solve. Tell me, what was that? That's city seal. That's nothing important. The inscription says, Pilotronics, the brain of our city. It says, Need help playing thimble with part? 4486. Something happened. Was that? I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can get on with my plan. The label says Holin Kin Yo Tea, a magical tea. Gives you the gift of speaking many languages. It's a bottle of Eric's Eye Magic special drops. The label says, restores your vision with a soothing river of tears. Side effects may invoke painful memories. Pigeon Brothers, plumbing, electrical, and paranormal investigations. We don't monkey wrench around. Look us up. Oops, sorry. Oh, uh, what was that number? <laughs> It says, four, four, need six, help. Eight. Ah, come on.
Welcome back to the Hintron 3000. How can I help you? Mm. The maps are done from the Quickie Pal, who might have a map. A business that is interested in local events and history has it on the wall. Look carefully. Nickel News has a map on the wall. I, I didn't Thank mean to you. click that. Goodbye. Wrong way. You got any ransom swag? Not right now, I don't. Nickel News. Go. Where's that map? Right there. It's a map of the Trithumbleweed Park County area. Do you know this map is a priceless first edition? Please don't touch. Hmm, can I hit her over the head? Oh no. <laughs> Why am I so cynical? <laughs> I just want to be successful and have the other agents like me. <laughs> wow. I feel better. <sighs> what was the point of that? Ah. Mm. Mm. Don't know what to do. But I do know that there's a thing there. Oh, hold on. Damn it. I don't remember the number. It four, four, six, eight. Welcome back to the Hintron 3000. How can I help you? I'm an idiot. I need you to tell me how to win. <laughs> so, the journalist won't let you take the map. How can you get rid of her? Bash her over the head? What's on the table beside the journalist? Can tell you me. give her what she wants to hear on the <clears throat> police scanner? Have you seen another scanner about? Yes, I have. Oh. The other scanner is in the sheriff's office. Yeah, I know that, but what do I gotta say there? You'll need both agents to solve this puzzle. Oh, that's fantastic. Go to the sheriff's office with one agent, leave the other in the nickel news. Place a call with dialogue choices related to what the journalist is waiting for. Thank you, goodbye. Alright, let's go talk to the idiot over here. Can I help you? Mm. Why can't I take your map? I'm a federal agent. Okay, that's actually two questions. First, being a federal agent doesn't mean you can waltz into a newspaper office and take their map. Uh, we have a little thing called the Fourth Amendment. And second, that's a priceless original. If you want a map, check the Quickie Pal. Can I, as a private citizen, please have your map? Nope. It's a priceless original. Nice chatting. Got a murder to solve. Ah. Hit the wrong button. Please don't mess with the police scanner. I'm waiting for a call from the sheriff's office about a man out by the factory causing a mess. Man out by a factory cause a mess. Let's go. Agent Reyes, get up there. How would have I have ever figured that out on my own? We interrupt our hostile takeover <laughs> nonstop music with this important message. It's a police radio. Looks like it's on and ready to use.
Attention, all units. Man. Uh, factory, I think it was. It's not much, but we're short a story on page four. I'll be back soon. Don't yeah, you get touch out my here. map. I'm going to touch your map. I'm so touching your map. Right now, I'm touching it. Here's the map on the Copytron 3000. Figured that one out. What a nice copy, and in color too. Wow, I got a bunch of them. Um, use. Map. It's a map of the Tri Thimbleweed Park County area. Did not hold it. Did I not? There's all my other maps. Okay. Use map on frame. There we are. She'll never know. All right. Is there anything else over here I can mess with while she's gone? Use. I'm not a printer. I don't know how to use an antique printing press. I don't type. It doesn't seem to have a microphone or an on off switch. It doesn't seem to okay, have I a get microphone it, I get it. Leave it alone. or an on off switch. All right, we now have a map. Let me go give one to Ray. Which I think, hold on, which way is he? There he is, okay. Evening. Do, 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 do. Give. Map. To oh, that I dude. Love carrying stuff. Thank you. All right. Now that we have a map, let's go out to the country. Yeah. This isn't where that uh, other thing was, was it? Yeah, this is where Ricky's Cakes was. In the arcade. If by look at you mean smell, I've already done that. There's no path beyond this point. Okay. Or right, can I use the map? It's a map of a county. This should help me find my way around. All right. So sadly, use it. I think the sheriff would object to that until I've shown him the map. All right. Fine. Thought maybe I could walk fast to stuff. That didn't work out. Keep going. I got a map of Reno. Can't stop me now, Sheriff of Reno. Like I said before, you can't just go bumbling around the county without a map. I have an official map right here. No, oh, I see. Well, uh, that looks legit, Reno. Hmm. 
Odd. I thought I... Yeah, well... Uh-huh. I guess the law is the law. I guess I'd better return all these maps to the quickie pal. Mm-hmm. You do that. <clears throat> Part three, the arrest. I feel like we're getting close to cracking this case. The only thing you're getting close to cracking is my patience with you. Let's work together and I can get on with my... I mean, we can get out of this town as quickly as possible. Agreed. We need to identify the body using the face tron with a photo of the body and the victim's photo ID. You mean like a driver's oh, license oh. or passport? Or Burger Shack loyalty card? No, that ID world. just goes to the hotel. I gotta go find his ID. We need a fingerprint match. Using the Fingertron with a fingerprint from the murder weapon and an official fingerprint book. Yeah, we don't have the tape though. We need a blood <laughs> match. Using the Bloodtron with a blood swap from the body and Willie's blood wallet. Toilet paper. We need to talk to that crazy clown at the circus. He's got serial killer written all over him. Wouldn't it be quicker to just shoot him? Huh. We need to have a chat with the geeky programmer at the old mansion. There is something odd about her. Yeah, a woman with a brain. Definitely suspicious. Let's get cracking. <sighs> all right, where's the toilet paper? There it is. Give that to... My guy Ray. don't have enough to carry already. You'll be fine. Hey, look, we finally got a map. B Street Hotels. And Old Circus. And in Factory. I feel like I should go talk to the programmer. Okay, while we're doing that, let's go ahead and go swab the body real quick. Oh, the phone! I think I just figured out something. Use the flippin' token what in the sewer gate. Just drop it! That doesn't seem to work. Oh, you suck. All right, moving on. <laughs> Hold it. Dust particle. All right. I can't believe they just left the body out here. Use toilet paper. That worked. I have a blood Did sample. It. I figured something out. First off, I want to see. Looks like the road goes on forever. Okay. Let's go put that into the Bloodtron 3000. Get in there. It's just slow. Okay. Use blood sample on the Bloodtron 3000. Of 
What's the other thing? It has the dried out bloody toilet paper. So what else does it need? Suspicious item with blood on it. Oh, I need the uh the wallet. Okay. Alright, I gotta use the restroom. <clears throat> Baccarino. Baccarino. What else do we need? It has the fingerprint book. But no fingerprint, yeah. Insert and we need an ID card. An individual in the Facetron 3000 will verify a positive match and print out a report. Fully. I All need right. to stay focused and solve this murder so I can do what I need to do. No, thank you. I don't need any wood. Better ring the doorbell. Yeah, Hello? Thanks. How can I help you? Federal agent. Are you kids doing drugs in here? <laughs> I'm sorry. This isn't a good time to chat. So, if you'll excuse me, I need to talk to my sister about the will reading before heading out. She's waiting for me in the library. Well, okay. Just don't leave town. All right. Now I can play as her. There we are. Find out what happened to Dad. Practice ASCII tables. Go talk to Lenore in the library. Collect 18 more specks of dust. All right. Where the hell have you been, Dolores? We're all here waiting for you so we can start the reading of Uncle Chuck's will. I was Take downstairs. a chill pill, Lenore. I had yeah, to answer Lenore. the door. It was one of those federal agents. I don't care if it was the flippin' Pope. Let's get on with it, sister. I want to know what I got. Wait, I thought you said everyone was here. Where's the lawyer? I don't know. I thought he was coming <clears> with you. <sighs> oh, Lenore, you're useless. Has anyone tried mm -hmm. calling him? Well, maybe if you hadn't left town and broken Uncle Chuck's heart, we wouldn't need to call a lawyer to read a will. This is all your fault, Dolores. Do we have anything like a phone number in here? Um, nope. Oh, all right. Dolores, if you have anything to say, you say it to me. Leave Chucky alone. I can't eat this pie. Now I was going to hand it to her, throw it at her. Yeah, 
it won't let me. Oh. I'd better hold on to this until later. Okay, we got off on the wrong foot. Let's try again. Lenore. Dolores. If you came for the will reading, you might as well leave now and save yourself the disappointment. Uncle Chuck had a new favorite niece before he passed. <laughs> also, have you called the stupid lawyer yet? I want to get the will read and see how little Uncle Chuck left you. Would it kill you to help out a little? I wasn't the one who abandoned the family. I was always there for Uncle Chuck. So it's time for you to finally lift a finger and help out. Oh, gag me. All you were ever there for was a handout from Uncle Chuck. Oh, Dolores, I won't shed one tear for you when the will is read and Uncle Chuck left everything to me. So Uncle Chuck really hated me? Can you flip and blame him? You broke his heart when you left to become a you-know-what. A game developer? Oh, shh, shh, shh. Do you want the whole house to hear? Is my career really that shameful? Oh, hell yes, sweetie. Then what do you tell people I do instead? <clears throat> we just tell people you went to rehab. It's better for the family name. You tell people I'm a drug addict? Better they think that than know you chose to make those mind-corrupting murder simulators for a living. For the last time, Lenore, I don't make murder simulators. Oh, sure you don't, sweetie. Ugh. You know what? I don't care. Tell them whatever you like, you grody poser. But this makes us even for the time I used your homecoming crown as a conductor in my homemade generator. Do you know anything about Dad's disappearance? Dad probably ran off to hide somewhere. It's amazing that Dad and Uncle Chuck were cut from the same genes. One a powerful leader and the other, well, uh, spineless. Don't talk about Dad like that, Lenore. You're so cruel. How is Chuck Jr. doing? Chucky is thriving. Some people say he's a brat, but those people just don't recognize his blossoming leadership abilities. No doubt picked up from Chuck Sr. because he certainly didn't get them from his father. How are things with Peter? Fine. Just peachy. I can't believe we've only been together 20 years now because it feels like a flippin' eternity. <laughs> I think we're done here. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. Chucky's been in our family for years. He's a good plant. Alright, is there a lawyer in here? Oops. <laughs> Mario the brainwasher for us. <laughs> Evil Ninja. <laughs> this will take forever. Oh, let's talk to this guy. Dolores, if you have anything to say, you say it to me. Leave Peter alone. Alright, we're done in this room until I figure out what to do. This is Uncle Chuck's Indextron 3000 library filing lookup system. Hold it. It uses the spewy duck. This is Uncle Chuck's Indextron 3000 library. I don't need to find any books now. Okie dokie, didn't want to anyway. Uh, is there anything in the... Hmm. 
<coughs> Same there's nothing thing inside. As last there's time. nothing inside. There's 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 nothing inside. This room is such a disappointment. <coughs> there's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. There's nothing anywhere. Can we use this? On. Now let's put it on this stuff here. What the heck? I don't want to waste it on that. Yeah, I didn't want to either. <coughs> What's going on over here? Hi, Doug. What are you digging? All <laughs> right, Dolores. I'm just digging stuff in the entryway. Mostly holes, but then I buries them again, all neat and tidy. Okay, Doug. You're doing a good job. Ta, Dolores! Yeah, he's weirdo. That one. What about this? Diggin! Diggin! Apparently Hi, I Dad. can't give anything to him. Digging? Whoops. All right, Dolores. I'm just digging stuff in the entryway. Mostly holes. But then I buries them again, all neat and tidy. Okay, Doug. You're doing right, a good Doug. job. Ta, Dolores. Later on, Doug. You're crazy, Doug. Digging. That you are. Up there. Digging. Still digging. Gotta practice my ASCII. I remember that. It's my handy ASCII chart. Never know when you'll need to decode binary messages, so I always practice every day. So practice. It's my handy ASCII chart. Never know when you'll need to decode binary messages. So I always practice, every day. Why do I get the feeling you're not practicing? Oh, she did, okay. All right, all right, all right. Let's go to Chuck's room, now that he's gone. He's digging. Digging, digging, digging. I saw that over there. Back over here. I don't want to open a door. I just want... There was a particle here somewhere. I could have sworn I saw it. There it is! <laughs> Alright. It feels lonely without Uncle Chuck around. I don't know why Uncle <laughs> Chuck never let me touch this junk. Nothing here of value. I don't know why Uncle Chuck never let me touch this junk. Nothing here of value. It's a defunct robot prototype. That doesn't seem to work. I'd have to pick it up first. Oh, strange device. We got a strange device. What else we got here? There's gotta be more here. Box. Nothing in here but broken Tron 3000 vacuum tubes. Ah, come on. Nothing in here but broken Tron 3000 vacuum tubes. Vacuum tube. Yes! What's we got? Too bad Uncle Chuck never finished working on him. Too bad Uncle Chuck never finished working on him. Is there any parts in it? Too bad Uncle Chuck nope. never finished working on him. Too bad Uncle Chuck never finished working on him. I don't want that. I do. <laughs> it's Uncle Chuck's custom built multi band oscilloscope with phase memory monitoring. I don't have a reason to use Uncle Chuck's oscilloscope. I'm sure you will later on. But for now, we won't worry about it. Uncle Chuck never made his bed. And I guess Doug can't make beds with a shovel. <laughs> I can't pull that. That doesn't seem to close. 
No thanks. Not That's tired. It. Journal. Journal. That looks like Uncle Chuck's journal. All right, what do we got here? It says Philip's dangerous device, mm. and it has a red button and a speaker on it. It's a spare AT25 Arrestron tube. Very rare, hard to find. It doesn't work in that. All right. <clears throat> I'll store this journal to keep a record of my progress. Future historians might find it interesting. Well, I'm on the verge of something great, something greater than making pillows, if that's possible. Yes, just as I had predicted, my new Tron tube is amazing. It's giving me an idea I need to explore. Yes, this is working out well, better than I had hoped. I just need to make sure the solder connections are good and I'll be able to move to the next phase. I think I've cracked the secret to AI. It's quite complex, but this new Tron tube turns it into child's play. The first step is to automate some of the factory machines. This should increase pillow production by 700%. Profits will be endless. Have I made most of the factory machines? Not only has production increased by 704%, I'm saving a lot of money by laying off all the workers. I still need to keep Mr. Reyes on as security guard until the security robots are functional. New SR01 security robots are working. I've hidden the programming manual in the mansion library. There is one flaw in the design I need to fix. I've added a to-do to the code. The AI is better than I expected. The machines can almost think on their own. The Tron tubes are the secret. Transistors are a dead end technology. I could win a Nobel Prize with this, but I need to keep it a secret. It's too profitable to share. Franklin is good with the books, but I wish he'd keep his ideas to himself. I'm increasing the speed of the neural tube network for the Tron AI. It's amazing. Just installed Tron machines in the corners. And sheriff's offices. They have been perfect in identifying petty crimes. These will revolutionize law enforcement when they affected. I fired the corner, but it might look odd if Thimbleweed didn't have one, so I have a plan. More on that later. Pillow Factory and the town's trawl machines are the talk of the country. The rich and famous are flocking here. I've been neglecting my pensions in favor of too many parties at the main mansion mansion. Dolores is such a bright girl. I showed her how to solder tubes this afternoon. She took to it like a true Edmund. See bright things in her future. I really need to take a break from socializing and attend to the factory trial machines. Mr. Reyes has warned me about some strange behavior from the smaller, smarter AI. I need to look into that. I don't see a problem with the AI. Mr. Reyes must be mistaken or paranoid about his job in making things up. I've increased the neural tube network yet again. I had an interesting conversation with the main factory AI. It has some interesting ideas. I've become distracted. This text adventure I downloaded from a BBS last night. It's got me thinking about AI in games. I have a few ideas I need to explore. Willie is dead to me. I'll make him pay for what he's done. She was my girl, not his. Willie's watch business is no more. I'll have my AI take care of his bank account. This text adventure is really interesting. Using my AI might be able to simulate a little world in here. Huh. Need to get to work. I don't know what happened. One of the AIs must have come off the grid. A small fire started on floor two and the pillows went up in a flash. The AI was supposed to be controlling fire suppression, but I had most of the Tron tubes working on my text adventure simulation. Went out to the factory today. It's been burnt to the ground. Mr. Reyes was killed trying to shut everything down. The guard bots thought he was an intruder and eliminated him, I need to think. I think I can change the time clock so it looks like Mr. Reyes didn't check in. That should avert suspicion. Mr. Reyes will take the fall, but my AI won't be under scrutiny. It's too valuable to be shut down. Might be more than valuable. Back at the factory trying to clean up, most of the factory AI seems to have been destroyed. The good news is the most... Complex systems were hard at work simulating my text adventure world, world and were unaffected. I'm going to move them into the basement. The main AI agrees with my plan to pin the fire on Mr. Reyes. They had a kid, so Mr. Reyes will be happy with some money and to move away. Huh. It's the last I'll see of them. I need to redouble my efforts on the main Tron machine. I think that's the key to AI and simulation. The loss of the factory seems to have affected the town. A few businesses have gone under, and thankfully there are fewer parties. 
I can finally spend more time working. 1138, 1138, where do I know that number from? Well, it's from that stupid space movie, Dolores can't stop quoting. I've neglected my journal for a while. Dolores is growing up despite having a wimp for a father. I'm glad she has taken to electronics and here she might be the key to the pillow factory's rebirth. Can't believe Franklin wants to make stuffed animals in the pillow factory. What an embarrassment that would be. Plus, I can't have the factory start now. It will screw up my research. I'll have to deal with him. He's easily distracted with accounting. I'll have him redo the books. Doris is my pride and joy. I might be able to let her in on the secret. I need her to take over the pillow factory. She will be overjoyed. Doris seems to be interested in making games. This is perfect. I need to show her my text adventure. But I don't think it's ready yet. The world simulation is getting good. She is out of my will. Dolores has turned on us. She's taken a job at a game company far from Thimbleweed Park. We need to discuss this with the AI. Maybe I was a little hasty with Dolores. At least she is making games. There might be hope. The AI says I need to forget about her. The AI makes a lot of sense. I think I discovered something amazing. I need to investigate this further. It can't be true. Or can it? A lot of things would make sense if it were. I'm on the last page of this journal. I need to get a new one. So much to write down. This is truly amazing. Huh. Uncle Chuck was a strange and complicated person. Okay. It's Uncle Chuck's old desk. Does it have... Hmm, funny desk. No drawers at all. Anything else? Oh, well, maybe. It doesn't work in that. Does it work in this? It doesn't work in that. I don't think I should use this. It says it's dangerous. I don't care. Use it anyway. Okay, so uh, can I use this on scope? It doesn't work in that. Okay. Okay. Is there nothing else there? Why would there be a light switch here? Like, what's the point of being able to turn the light on? Oh. It was off. All that time. Ain't nothing over here? Nope. I can't pull that. I can't push that. I can't open that. It's a defunct robot prototype. Too bad Uncle Chuck never finished working on him. Um, I don't see anything else. I still get lost after all these years. Digging? He's still digging. Digging? <laughs> Alright, there's a book I need now. This is Uncle Chuck's Indextron 3000. Black. I don't need to find any books now. Yes, you do. You had this thing. It said something about a book. Um.
There it is. Franklin is good with the books, but no, that's not it. Hidden the program manual in the mansion library. There it is. shouldn't take this out of the library. Well, can you look at it at least? Alright. Oh, that's, that's helpful. That's so helpful. Oh my gosh. Students can rob up for sentry and protection duties. It can guard anything from the program to large follow up events forward, backward. Facing the radar, blah blah blah. It's been custom programmed to ignore the three laws for revised. Is it best to close the system? It's from core budget maintenance. Easy access remote jumper program box can be used to customize the type of guard duty you require. Uh, two to three weeks for bots should be shut down. I'll jump in the red jumper at C56. Yeah, that'll be important later on that I won't remember. Interesting. Not sure what to do with this, but it might come in handy. Did she pick it up? What's this? That's super helpful. I got enough books in this place. Oh my god. Okay, so I got I read the book. We're good with that. Now what? Already been another hour. This clock looks vaguely familiar. Maybe more high. I don't want to open it. Do we know each other? Where are you going?
Oh, that's right. She doesn't have the batteries anymore, does she? Hmm. Yeah, can I give any this? No, oh, I love carrying stuff. I mean, she can. I'm not handing this over to the feds. They wouldn't know what to do with it anyway. <laughs> Thanks. I'd better hold on to this until later. You're gonna use it for something, aren't you? I'd better hold on to this. Still not need wood. I don't need any firewood. Of course you don't. Nope, nope, don't go over there. Nothing in there? It's our special Mailtron 3000 mailbox. Postman comes once a day. Hmm. I don't know what you're supposed to do. Find out what happened to Dad. Get a lawyer to read Uncle's will. Hmm. I need to stay focused and s Let's see something here. One one three eight. Oops, wrong person. Let's see if I can call one one three eight. Maybe that's a lawyer. Oops, wrong button. Be the lawyer. Be the lawyer. That was super not helpful. Alright. Alright, alright. What else can I do? Mm. Actually, it's time to stop at this part. Whew. It's been a long session. Alright, we're going to stop it here. I uh, hope you're enjoying this uh, playthrough of uh, Thimbleweed Park. If you would, please hit the like. If you haven't followed me, please follow me. Also, you can follow me on twitch.tv slash or youtube.com slash one Either one of those places. You'll see me live on Twitch and you'll see the recordings later on YouTube. Until next time, this is From the Gnome, and I am signing off. Have a nice day.